Come now, tomorrow may be too late. You have perhaps decided to come to Jesus, but just not just now. Like Felix in the Bible, you say, Go the, thy way for this time. When I have a convenient season, I will call for thee. Satan knows that if you put religion off, he is likely to keep you captive forever. God says, Today, if you will hear his voice, harden not your hearts. Behold, now is the day of salvation. Satan whispers, not today, but tomorrow. He promises you shall give to God all your future days, if only he can secure himself the present. Oh, beware of tomorrow. Souls are generally lost, not because they resolve never to repent, but because they defer it till some future time and still defer it till it is too late. Tomorrows have crowded hell. Perhaps you think you will wait till disease assails you, but a sick bed is the very worst place for repenting. Your mind may be so distracted by delirium, fever, or pain, or may so share in the weakness of the body as to be unable to think. The peace in which multitudes seem to die is, the o is only the apathy of disease. Many who are when, when are, they are ill have professed to repent, and recovery have become more careless than before. It was not a true conversion. And had they died, they would have been lost. There is little hope of salvation in sickness. But such a season may never come. You may die without a moment's warning. Though in health today, you may be dead tomorrow. And, and are you, when life is oh so uncertain, putting off salvation? A prisoner is under the sentence of death. He knows not the fatal hour, but is told that if before it strikes, he petitions the governor, his life will be spared. He says, I'll send tomorrow. And when tomorrow comes again, oh, there's time enough yet. I'll wait a little longer. Suddenly his door opens, and behold, the sheriff and the executor. Oh, wait, and I'll write the petition. No, they say, the clock has struck. It's too late. You must die. Poor sinner, you are condemned. You know not when you may die. It may be this very day. You put off repentance until tomorrow, but tomorrow you may be in hell. Christ knocks today, but remember, death may knock tomorrow. Though you keep your best friend outside, death will burst in and hurry you away to the judge. Come to Jesus today. He is willing to save today. Heaven's gate is open today. Tomorrow may be too late.